Left elbow, 14 footer, that's no good, but it's tipped in by Terrence Jennings. So the Bayhawks with two offensive rebounds on the game's first possession, they came in to this one last in the league in that category. The Springfield bench wanted to travel, didn't get it. Jackson now backdoor alley-oop, and Terrence Jennings fires it home. Well, that pass from Jackson was from about 40 feet out. And it is a 55-49 Erie lead here in the nascent stages of the third period. Jackson to the foul line, down the lane he goes, drops it off, and Jennings jams it with two hands. And the left forecourt now loses it. Jennings comes up with a steal, off to the races. Look out below as he jams it with two hands. So Jennings... Downs comes down with a rebound. Jackson drops it off to Brownlee, who kicks it down low, and Jennings fires home another one. And it's a 78-75 Erie lead. Here's Davis again on the left side. Sends it up top to Jackson. And Lewis bounces into the lane. Jennings with a jump hook, and he scores. Sideline. To Jennings, just right at the top of the key. So he gives it to Jackson now. Works his way inside the foul line. Alley-oop, and Jennings fires it home. So Coach Ross and the Bayhouse success all season as long as they try to contend for a D-League championship. Obviously, they're not. 720 left. Suggs to the top of the key. Goes left side. Micah Downs back to Suggs. Fakes a three. Puts it on the floor. Floats it up top. Down low. And Jennings lays it in. Second as well. Seven-point lead. Jackson across the timeline with 14 seconds left. Kicks it up top. Jennings, one dribble. 15-footer for the right elbow. The try is good. We're back to a three-possession game. And so... That pretty much should put this one in the books. Jennings across the timeline is going to pull up with a three-pointer, and he knocks it down with 2.1.